Have you noticed how everyone's suddenly talking about agent-to-agent -agent and model context protocol? They sound similar, right? Both are hot topics in the world of AI automation and intelligence systems, but they actually solve two very different problems. Let's break down agent-to-agent, -agent, or A2A, versus Model Context Protocol, or MCP, and why they matter for the future of enterprise AI. Agent-to-agent, -agent, or A2A, is all about communication. Think of it as a language layer that allows AI agents to talk to each other, share goals, and collaborate on tasks. For example, one AI agent might analyze a document while another summarizes it, and through A2A, they can coordinate in real time. It's about AI-to-AI -AI collaboration, where multiple agents combine their strengths to solve problems more efficiently. So, A2A connects minds, digital minds, working together toward a shared objective. Now, Model Context Protocol, or MCP, plays a different role. MCP connects an AI agent to real-world tools and systems, things like APIs, databases, or even Azure Logic Apps. Instead of agents just talking to each other, MCP gives them the ability to act, to trigger workflows, fetch data, or send messages securely. It defines how an AI model accesses these tools through a structured, standardized interface. So if A2A is how agents talk, MCP is how they do. It's the bridge between AI reasoning and system execution. When you combine A2A and MCP, you get something powerful. AI ecosystems where agents not only collaborate, but also take real action. A2A connects agents together. MCP connects those agents to enterprise systems. This means intelligent automation that's conversational, context-aware, and secure, where AI can talk, reason, and act inside your environment. It's the foundation of the next generation of agentic workflows in Azure and beyond. A2A connects AI to AI. MCP connects AI to the world. Together, they turn intelligent agents into intelligent systems. Check out my tutorial on how to build your own MCP server using Azure Logic Apps and Google Gemini.